right, I've wasted your all's time a lot more than I intended to. So, uh, let, uh, okay, now we're actually getting into the game, which I apologize. I, okay, so one of the things I got, I got a, um, a comment on one of my videos back with one of the alien videos stating hey you haven't talked for like 30 seconds and then gameplay wasn't for another minute 30. i was like okay i might understand the non-top uh uh not uh, not gameplay for not a minute 30. and then i looked at which video that it was that they commented on there was video gameplay all over the place it was one of the videos into the middle of my stream and they're like there was no actual gameplay for a minute 30. it's like you're looking at gameplay right now. It may be me scrolling around trying to figure stuff out. I may not be talking, but guess what? That's me sitting there thinking. It was one of those. It was at one of those points where, a uh, uh, point in times where it was, uh, where I was, it was my one of my uh, silent moments where I was sitting there um, processing and think, uh, thinking and processing. I didn't comment on that, but in my head, after looking at that, I was like, dude. How can you comment that when there you're actually looking at gameplay? If you're thinking gameplay is go fight aliens, boom, all right, combat. You think that's gameplay, then buddy, you have not played games for a long time. Anyways, here we are. And then sometimes streamers get into the point in time where they don't talk. They're not going to talk for a while. It's like really that, but buddy, Careful that now. that's a trap. That don't make sense. Well, that that comment actually does not make sense. Oh, that must have been like to blow things up. Yeah, that comment did not make any sense. So what? You never stopped. Um, you never stopped in your gameplay to think for a little while. Burning prophet. Uh, along Reaper's Bluffs, a statue stands guard over a circle of torches. Huh. The statue stands before you in silence. It reaches to the heavens, as if praying for release from its ch- Here lies Patrick, prophet. He perished in this place, predicting the downfall of Bracchus Rex. That's no way to die. Bracchus was quite the tyrant. Is this the Elements Torch thing? Uh... Or is it? Stay lit, damn it. Spirit vision. The spirit keeps glancing. How can I help? No. Oh.
Nick, have you played this game? You, I'm pretty sure you played this game, right? Chat. Am I being stupid on this? Unless... to the shrine got it as the torches around you flicker and crack to life you hear a low groan it starts soft then crescendos until your chest rattles and your head buzzes Which I suffer! God damn these burning flames! Don't move, you stand alert, your sense is primed. You boil my blood only to stand idle? The indignity fans the flames! Uh, do the torches. the flames hurt him? Your question only fans the flames! The anguish is unbearable! Just when the agony subsides, another pilgrim makes her way to the shrine and puts flame to the torches. They think to honor me. Instead, they incinerate me. Maybe I can help you out. The curse is everlasting. Whenever I am honored, I will suffer for it. Bracca saw to that. I knew him and knew his secrets. I saw his rise and fall as woven into the tapestry of time. He branded my truth as blasphemy, and I burn for it. I seen the hordes of Brax's re uh, Brax reign with your my own eyes. I wouldn't wish them on anyone. I live that horror. The truth invites danger. Some would sooner be swallowed by the void than tell it. Wait, Wait. you. I see it. You too follow a path consumed by fire. You must take my gift from among the flames. With it, you will know truth. With it, you can... The rumble reaches a deafening forte, then dissipates. The voice is gone. Only the whisper of the wind fills your ears. Ooh. Okay, what do we got? Blank, blank, oh. Uh, yeah, how about that? Ah, uh, there was no lamp or sun. Ugh. Okay. As you leave through the tome, a name catches your eye. Brackets Rex. There was no lamp or sun. Yes. Let me. It was a vending not as man. Never had, but has as element. You are the light of the sun. Okay. Okay. Possible long leash of the divine light as a fisher might. One second, Jed.
Okay. Um, well, we need to get to you. Oh, oh. I don't like this. And metal scraps is nice. Having nails is always nice. The enormous stone slab is covered with cryptic engravings, obscured in places by smears of dried blood. I remember this. The book detailed old dwarven myths, including a creature called Duna's Undertaker. This slab is an altar once used to initiate its followers. Death Heralds would summon the creature by placing sauce-infused mutton on the altar. The creature then demanded a ritual. Unfortunately, the pages describing the ritual had been... The air around the altar thrums expectantly. Duna's undertaker awaits an offer. Do I have any mutton? That wasn't it. Um, no. I think I sold it.
Any hints, chat? Requisition. Sorcerer hold. Pumpkins, uh, pumpkin seed. Flower. One crate. Sunflower. One. Turnips. Three. Cabbage. One. Human ale. Ah. Oh, no. That's... This is uh, not great. Do, 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 do. Uh, what am I looking at? I'm looking at uh, Mortis. Oh, we're gonna, um, um, yeah, we're gonna like to ignore this. A genie lamp. Oh my god, that's a genie hey, lamp. Look, a lamp. Lying at your feet is a strange lamp of ancient design. Spots of gold shimmer through the thick grime that, as you hunker down for a closer look, the lamp jerks slightly, almost imperceptibly. You are become with the urge to rub this lamp. Give in and wipe the it. The lamp feels strangely hot to your touch. As you wipe away the years of dirt and grime, it trembles in your hand. Heavy smoke spills out of the spout of the lamp, falling to your feet, where it flows away from you. The va Who summons m What? One of you? His face twists into a sneer, and he flexes his claws. What's wrong, God Woken? Did the Seven turn you down too? Or are you here seeking even more power? I should strike you down where you stand, God Taint. Why would you kill... Why would he kill you for being God Wobbegan? Because it would be a kindness. I've known the power you feel, the promises you were made. I too was named God Woken once. 
My god gave it all. Power, glory, hope. It was intoxicating. Until she took it away. Deep inside, you can feel your god stirring. It's recoiling, revolted. No wonder Zor Stissa turned this one away. Unworthy, she said. Unworthy to be the vine. So she gave it to another. What kind of a monster gives you that power only to strip it from you? To promise you will be the light of the world and then cast you into darkness. Uh, what did you know? What did you, uh, what he did then? There was so much wrong with the world, so much that I needed to fix. So I sought power elsewhere. The void said I could have eternal power, that I could be the light of the world, and it delivered. I have power unlike any god woken. Even if I lack my freedom, it laughed as I was sealed away in that lamp. Be the light of the world, God Woken, it said. Even so, it was more honest than your hellish seven. Tell me the fool, power is nothing without freedom. I may be bound to that lamp, but I can still strike you down with a thought. Other fools will find my prison. I will have my freedom someday. And until then, I am happy to do my bit to rid the world of one god's puppet. The next passing imbecile can have your wish. Um, Persuasion Mystic. I'll say that you, you, know, you can see the good in him. He does not need to do this. As treacherous as the gods that tainted you. Anyways, hold on a second, chat. I need to blow my nose. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, so we're starting... Uh, okay. Well then. Um, Go, oh God. You have a lot of armor on you. We'll go ahead and really? Oh. Oh dear. Oh right, because of anyways. Oh. 
still have nine armor on you. Oh, come on. Really? Oh, that's physical armor. Whoops. Um, I'd rather just stay down. You know what? I think I'm actually going to delay my turn. I was hoping to be able to teleport him, but uh, he's way the F up there. I probably had... I do probably not have a good line of sight of him. No, I wanted blood infused. Well, let's get him up there. Oh, and he fell. Oh, can none of my dudes get up there? At least I can still hit him. All right, so he's going to take his time to... Get up, and so we can... Oh, oh, come on, really? Fine. Get a little higher. Hmm. 
I see. I see, I see, I see. Um, I'm going to delay his turn just in case she's not able to get up here. And oh, yep, we'll be able to knock him down. That'll work. Yoink. Oh, he's got 38 on him. Wait, how much is that going to do? Going to do 21 to 23 physical. takes two though so all right i'm not able to knock him down wait how much are you oh still not enough if i ever play this uh if you ever play this again i want to play as the red prince yeah there, there you go You do not have torture, so this would not work out. So I think I'll just go ahead and... I think I'll go ahead and just do this. Oh, did not freeze the ground. Oh, he is frozen on the ground. I only played as uh, original characters first, Ifen, and then Fane. Oh, okay. 